to acquire all this since the pandemic? That's yeah. correct. Incoming Governor Kathy Hochul wound her way through the hallways of PS 143 in Corona, Queens with local leaders, including city schools chancellor Misha Porter. So if ever, for some reason. The newly renovated building will soon welcome back students who one year ago lived in the epicenter of the epicenter of the country's pandemic. This time away from school, away from their support system, away from the life they used to know has been debilitating for too many of our children. Hochul acknowledged the fear so many face right now with the Delta variant surging and has already signaled she believes she has the authority through the health department to require masking in all schools, even without the special pandemic powers Governor Cuomo had for much of the last year and a half. The local school boards and superintendents are looking to the state for that leadership. She says aside from back to school, her other top priorities include distributing rent relief and cash for excluded workers, two crucial pandemic recovery programs that have floundered as Governor Cuomo was engulfed in scandal. But there are people out there who are desperate for this money. The Buffalo area native has also spent much of this transition connecting with downstate leaders, having met with Mayor de Blasio Tuesday. Across town today during his daily press briefing, the mayor gave her a glowing review while throwing some not so subtle shade at his long time nemesis, Governor Cuomo. It was just a good, healthy, sane, emphasizing the word sane conversation. Really honored that the mayor called me sane. That's good. <laughs> Kidding aside, the mayor and soon to be governor say the crux of the conversation was about combating COVID. Hochul has committed to picking someone from the city as her lieutenant governor, but says she'll take about 45 days to put her entire team together. All questions will be ultimately answered, but I need the time to continue interviews listening to people, getting people's opinions, and putting together the dream team to run the state of New York.